hey everyone welcome to the channel today i am going to guide you how you can implement policies on your indexes or the indices in your wazoo server for this i am going to use the default instructions provided by the wazoo you can try simply wazoo index management in your browser and click on this wazoo index management here you have to follow these instructions if you are using wazoo with kibana elastic search right so i am going to access my wazoo server in the browser have to log in your gui account for the wazu server The GUI team takes a bit time to get ready. You guys were familiar with this. It always took some time if uh, we have rebooted the Wazu server or restarted the Wazu server. If the server is uh, running 24 by 7 in your environment, then it will not take as much time it taking right now okay we are going to refresh it right from the menu main menu you will have to go to this index management first now if you want to create a new policy you have to go to the state management policy if you if you already running policies on your server you can go with this menu and here are the indices which has been created please make sure not to delete one of these indices right if we are going to delete the indices manually then we have to simply click any of the indice which we want to delete and click on this action button and you can see here the delete button and type this delete in it and click on this button and this is how you can delete the in indice manually if you want to implement policies on this and we are going to create a automatic policy we are going to use visual editor and this is the policy id we are going to name according to our memorization
now we are going to add the states we have to add an ism template that ism template will automatically apply the policy to indices created in the future okay we are going to click index pattern what will be the index pattern we are going to do this later now do this we are going to add some state 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 1 need to add action what the what type of action you want to add i am going to add the action here this is the first action if you want to add other now we are going to click on this shrink action and add the action save this state now check if the if we can create an ism pattern and add template click on this after the delete action we have two actions in this state okay we are going to edit this and add only one action it in it now add another state shrink it will run before the state one and this is the state two we are going to add, add the action and save this state now we have successfully created the first state is delete but it will run after this shrink state and click on this create button to create a policy okay now if we want to apply any policy we will search it and apply the policy this is how you can imply, apply the policy and how you can create the policy first we will create the policy that the data will be shrinked and then it will be deleted and how we are going to that apply that policy on our indices you have to select the indice and click on the apply policy button and select the policy which one you want to apply and click on apply button this this is how you can create the policy in wazoo and apply these policies automatically to your indices why we do that we 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 does this to automatic delete our indices which get older and which get larger in in size 
this is how you can create the policies in Vazu and how you can manage your indices what are the indices indices are the data which work which will be created or which were created while the Vazu server is running either these are the statistics log either it's the monitoring log either these are the alerts log this is how you can manage your indices in your Wazoo server hope you guys like my video and understand the instructions very well please like and subscribe my channel and share with your friends colleagues and students until then stay blessed stay tuned thank you for watching goodbye